Hey, what's up everyone? It's uh, Yuma here. Uh, today I'll be doing a little house tour for you. Um, I've never actually done a voiceover for a video, so if you do get sick and tired of the voice, just uh, <laughs> just hit the mute button. But yeah, without wasting any more time, let's get into it. So this is the inside of my house. Uh, you have the aquarium separated from the rest. So let's start in there. On the wall you have shark head, a uh, pawn broker, and in the middle you have the aquarium, so let's have a little look inside. Got a bunch of fish swimming about, sharks, salmon, swordfish, decorations everywhere, sandcastle, treasure chest, boat. It's pretty cool in here to be honest. But yeah, that's the aquarium. Back upstairs. Just change the skybox real quick, make it midday. Outside you've got a couple of gardens, uh, either side of the throne room. Uh, to get the aquarium where it was I had to build rooms to the aquarium and then remove the rooms. But I think it was worth it. So the throne room. And the most expensive part of my house is probably the demonic thrones. But they're pretty cool to look at. And then in the middle you have the barrier where you can teleport them out or keep them in. Uh, send them to the dungeon. I will show you that in a moment. Another garden with a fountain. Uh, to the left you have a workshop where you repair your armour, change your banner, make some clockwork toys. On the right hand side you have a kitchen. Pretty standard, got a little cat rug in the corner. The first set of stairs that lead upstairs and downstairs into the dungeon. In the middle, uh, the portal room. And then on the other side you have another set of stairs, which do the same. Little bobblehead, King Black Dragon on the wall. The parlour, where you have a little sit down, or the lounge. And the first of my two portal rooms, which I've never really used, but they are cool to look at. Uh, the place where you feed your animals, I can't pronounce it. But I've got mostly boss pets, so I don't need to. The dining room and the second portal room with a few more portals. So yeah, in the background I've got a Christmas tree I've never taken down and it's always in the same spot but I always keep it up. And lastly you have a chapel where you do your prayer, um, the best god obviously. And yeah, that's basically the ground floor, got a little organ as well. So now to show you the upstairs. Let's change the skybox again. So the first bedroom where the butler sleeps and on the opposite side is the other bedroom. Now we have the combat room which is cool because it has like different weapons and stuff. And in the corner you have the games room. Um, I don't think there's anything in the chest to be honest. And the stone hissing thing that's made out of marble. And a little archery target. Another parlour to sit. Fireplace. Which I can't like, makes sense. Need some logs. Uh, the study in the corner. A uh, statue that I've just never built. And the other combat room, which I prefer because you get a little boxing gloves and the other bedroom which is basically identical to the butler's bedroom so yeah that is upstairs and now to show you the dungeon which could be better to be honest because i've exceeded the um the highest amount of rooms i could build so it's pretty incomplete uh the costume room which is in the dungeon for some reason. I didn't know where to put it, to be honest. All the different cosmetics I've acquired over the years. Sometimes I get the rings out because you transform into different characters. But yeah, that's that. And then you have the cape rack, which is incomplete. I need to add a few more capes to it, but I just haven't got around to it. 
in the middle, middle you got the magic wardrobe. Um, some mystic stuff in there. Uh, the armor case. There's a few things in there. Fishbowl head. Uh, the clue scroll chest, which is pretty bare as well because I did do a lot of clue scrolls. And when I do, I never really get anything decent. So I just haven't bothered. Got the hard one. Elite. And then master. Nothing in there. Oh yeah, that's the costume room. Oh, and in the middle. Uh, my costume and the prince's costume, stuff like that. So as for the dungeon, I've got a little fire pit in the middle. Uh, bone cage. Got a skeleton garden in the place. All my doors are steel. Then in each room I have a different uh, monster. So I've got a little spider there. Then basically on the other side I have exactly the same but just different monsters. So you've got a little guard dog and a troll. But yeah, I would expand the middle but I can't make any more rooms, so it's just a bit... I don't know what that is. The Citadel, I think. But yeah, that is basically my house. So yeah, that was my house tour. Uh, there's a few things I wish I could do better, like the dungeon. I wanted to add a few more rooms, but uh, construction hasn't been updated in forever. And I don't think it will for a while, so I'm just going to have to leave it like that. Um, any future videos, I might be doing some boss fights, so if you do get stuck with a boss, just keep a lookout and I might be able to help you out. But yeah, that's basically it. Uh, so until next time.